Hi guys and welcome to Classic Rock Country Music Facts and Trivia. Thank you for being here. Today's video is on Joe Walsh and uh, he returned to the scene of drink and his drink and drugs epiphany. Eagles icon Joe Walsh performed a short set to 300 people in heavy rain during a return to the place where he had his drink and drugs epiphany. On Sunday, he performed alongside a band of students at Otara, Pennsylvania, uh, more a fort near Hawks Bay, New Zealand, as PA, I guess, uh, where he told the audience about his experience there in 1989. I'm so grateful I could come back, the 76-year-old said via the New Zealand Herald. I'm kind of home in a way. Uh, his set included a local song, Eagles classic Desperado, and a cover of the Doors Roadhouse Blues, the accompaniment by the pupils of a nearby Terradale High School. Uh, Classic Rock reported uh, that Walsh also said, what happened to me was kind of a spiritual awakening. The spirit of this place talked to me and told me who I'd not become was not me. Continued the spirit that was here gave me power over all that. I took that power back to the United States and I stopped drinking and doing drugs and I tried to help people who were doing that. I paid a lot less attention to being famous and having fun spending money. Admitting he'd lost his perspective in the 80s, Walsh said, I came here and I got it back. I've been 30 years sober now, and that's because I came here. Where we are right now has so much good energy and spirit. In 2018, Walsh said he found his way into drink and drugs as a result of suffering stage fright and finding that a couple of beers helped deal with it, which planted the seed. God bless him, 30 years. He's got two years on me. I've been 28 years sober, um, but I'm here to tell you, um, I saw a special, Drew Carey's Improv All-Stars, and I think it was on HBO years ago, and uh, there's the guys from uh, Whose Line Is It Anyway, and Joe Walsh was there. He was a musical guest, but he got involved in part of the comedy as well, and I'm here to tell you, the guy was funnier than anybody on the stage, and I love Whose Line Is It Anyway, guys. And he was hilarious and stoned out of his head, but he was hilarious, man. So if you can find that on YouTube, look it up, watch it. It's worth the watch, guaranteed. Uh, what a guitar player, man. He's great. Uh, that's all I got for you. I hope you enjoyed this. Please don't forget about Classic TV, Facts and Trivia. Head on over there, check that out. Uh, please subscribe if you have not yet. Please like this video. Please share it out with your family and friends. You guys have a great day. God bless. I'm praying for you.